Okay, this is part 10 of Pokemon Black. Okay, so I did some major training and my Pokemon are higher level now. <clears throat> and if you talk to this girl right here, she gives you the TM94 Rock Smash. Now, Rock Smash <clears throat> is a great move this early in the game because it's it's got pretty high attack for this early in the game. It's a fighting type move, which is good against the next gym leader. And it's a TM in this generation, which means you can forget it whenever you want. Anyway, if you go in here, you'll see a bunch of Team Plasma dudes blocking your way. So you won't be able to go through there. Anyway, um, let's see. Let's switch out right here. Okay, if you go onto this grass, you can find a bunch of different Pokemon. One is this Pokemon, Timber. And Timber is one of three fighting types that you can find over here. The others are Throw and Sock. And Throw is harder to find in Pokemon Black and easier to find in Pokemon White. Sock is easier to find in Black and harder to find in White. But you can find Throws in Black and you can find Socks in White. Ha, <laughs> White Socks. Anyway, so yes, as you can see, I did do some training. So let's try to catch this because I may use this on my team. Really? You escaped? Okay. If I don't catch it in my next Pokeball, I'm in trouble. So, let's go Great Ball. Because I have one anyway. What? Really? I'll go into someone that I can let be killed. We're just going to Panpour, because I don't really care about Panpour. In fact, the Pokemon I was telling you about earlier in another episode, uh, that I'm going, it's a water type that I'm going to replace, or I'm going to replace Panpour with, it can be found here. Br this, this timber is getting on my last nerve. I mean, if I hit it anymore, next thing you know, I'll knock it out. But it won't even be freaking caught. Let's use a lick. Dang it, I was hoping to paralyze it. All right, there we go. Lake has an annoyingly high chance of paralyzing, and paralyze does make Pokemon easier to catch. So maybe that'll help. So now let's try to catch this timber. Finally, we, we caught the timber, and it, I'm starting to think it wasn't even worth it. I, I used like uh, five Pokeballs on this thing. Well, four Pokeballs and one Great Ball. Thought the Great Ball would do something, but. Muscle, okay. Now let's go and get muscle, shall we? Okay. <clears throat> ah, blah, 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 blah. I hate that I can't, like, just pause the videos that I take.
This is so annoying. <clears throat> My videos take longer. Just because, ugh. So I got like Blitzel, I caught this Audino, and then Dog, so. Let's check how our mystery egg is doing right quick. Okay. It may be close to hatching. Okay. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> okay. Now let's go back over here. Well, right quick. Um, rock smash. Uh, let's teach muscle rock smash. Let's forget. Hmm. Focus energy is an okay move, but it's never really worked out for me. Every time I use it, I never get critical hits, so. And the good thing is most Pokemon here are your level, or most wild Pokemon here are probably the levels that your Pokemon should normally be anyway, so if you catch a Pokemon here for your team, you probably don't even really have to train it. Oh, let just get, oh, and Boldat learned uh, Rock Blast, and Rock Blast is a great P-Dove killer. It's one of those repetitive hitting, repetitive hitting moves, but still, it's the earliest rock move you can learn, and it's still good to have a rock type attack this early in the game. Okay, so <clears throat> now let's talk to this little girl right here and get some experience after beating her in a battle. Okay. Preschooler Juliet. Well, where's Romeo? Anyway. Okay, so. <clears throat> She's gonna send out this cottony, and I'm going to send out chirps. And chirps, a uh, great leech seed. Leech seed is a move that takes a little HP from you every turn and gives it to the opponent. Anyway, chirps did learn air cutter. I made it forget. Uh, I made it forget uh, gust. And the good thing is, air cutter has a higher chance than most moves of hitting a critical hit. And uh, my P-Dove's ability is already super luck, which doubles your critical hit rate. So don't don't use a P-Dove that has big pecs. Big pecs, yeah, it prevents you from lowering defense, but it's not worth it. If you get a P-Dove, make sure it has super luck as its ability. Super Luck doubles your critical hit rate, and then Air Cutter already has a high critical hit rate. So, you already have a super high chance of hitting a critical hit. Now, Cottony in the Pinwheel Forest, Cottony is catchable in black, while Petalil, this thing, is only catchable in Pokemon White. So. Yes, and Leech Seed, even if the Pokemon that uses it gets knocked out, the other Pokemon still gets HP. Anyway, so, we'll just finish this thing off. Okay. <clears throat> okay, um... Go down here, there's just some more trainers right here, and then you can find an antidote. And um, let's see. And this, the dark grass. The dark grass is where you can find better Pokemon. Mm. I wanted to find a P-Dove when I wanted to catch one, but after I catch one, now I just think of P-Doves is really annoying to find. Well, let's just switch into muscle. And go battle this youngster right here. 
I'm brave and bold. Let's get right to the battle. So shall we get right to the battle? <clears throat> okay, Tim Pole. This little water tadpole thing. This is what I'm planning to replace Panpour with. However, I haven't found one yet. So, anyway. Let's, okay, Bubble Bean. Uh, we'll just go Rock Smash. Right there, Rock Smash already did half. And it gets super, oh, super sonic. No, I hate confusion. No, no. Confusion never works out for me. I always end up hitting myself. I always have the worst luck when I'm confused. Oh, thank you. I hate confusion. No, 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 no. Not another one, not another one. Timber is a rather good Pokemon to have on your team though. So, I would highly suggest using a timber or a throw or a sock. <clears throat> sock, which is, I thought about using a sock for a little while, which is the fighting type that you're more likely to find in Pokemon White. And, but, I just figured that I'd rather have a team of Pokemon that actually evolve, because I think evolving actually adds more you know, life to the walkthrough. So, I like to mainly use Pokemon that evolve because just feel like it adds more life to the walkthrough. Oh, three Tim Poles. I'm just glad that I avoided that last Supersonic. Whoa, yeah, you keep avoiding all those Supersonics. Okay. Kita, what kind of name is Kita? You're a guy, right? Just sounds kind of like a girl name. But... And if you uh, go to this nurse right here, they've actually added nurses and doctors to this game. And the nurse won't challenge you right when you pass by her, but if you talk to her, she has a Muna, but oh great muscle. <sighs> um, <clears throat> let's go into something that'll be able to take this better. better. Go, bold it. Oh no, siding. Come on, bold it. Oh no, don't be faster, don't be faster. Great. I should have known it would have been faster anyway. Freaking gosh. Annoying Munas! Well, it doesn't matter. After you win this battle, you won't have to worry about it anyway. But. Gosh. Physical moves are normally really good against Muna because it has low defense. Of course, not here I am lowering its defense to do more damage. Really? You avoid two, I would have rather you avoided the supersonics. Gosh. Thank you, a crit. Okay, lucky, ch oh, really? Lucky chant? Anyway, lucky chant prevents you from landing critical hits on your opponent if they use it, so. There goes the Muna, the annoying Muna. Okay, there we go. Snake's level 16. Okay, here we go. Leaf Tornado. Leaf Tornado is a great move for this part of the game. It's way more powerful than Vine Whip. It, it doesn't have that. It's like it's a, it has an accuracy of 95, so it will occasionally miss more than other moves. But other than that, Leaf Tornado is a great move to have. Yes, and in fact, I think you can talk to this train, this nurse every time, anytime you want. 
and heal your Pokemon. So, um, I'm actually gonna have to make a part two of the outside of Pinwheel Forest since I'm still trying to catch a Timple. So, uh, see you next time on Pokemon.